I've got family coming to town this weekend, so I can't spend too much time on making a video. But when I saw what you're about to see come up, I had to share it with you. I'm not going to bother editing out the swearing in the first part of this video, so you'll just have to grin and bear it. But just know that the swearing that you're about to hear is more than justified. I'm sure by now you've heard the expression, import the third world, become the third world. Well, it doesn't get more third world than dropping a deuce somewhere that isn't a bathroom. Elitist liberals will never understand what's going on here because they only promote multiculturalism. They don't actually live it. What you're about to see is something they will never see in their gated communities. It's we the people who always have to deal with this abhorrent behavior and look after it. And please, if you ever catch someone in the act of doing this, take action. Call the police right away and see to it that they face the consequences for doing this. So I'm tired of people saying that the people pooping on the beach, like that's what they do back home. We are not back home. We are in Canada. As a local, I refuse to let my kids dig in the sand on beach one. And you guys are saying all the tents are gone. No, they're not. No, they're fucking not. The beach is full of tents, full. And this is not including in the side areas of the beach. There is little treed areas there that is like mini forest, but it's cleared. So people can put up camp there. That is where they're still 100% doing it. And they are still 100% doing it on the beach, but more discreetly. Um, it is still happening. This, this is nothing that's going to change. People with that mentality will not change it. So people need to stop arguing with me and acting like this isn't happening. This is not just three years ago. This is today. This is this week. This is still happening. The tents are still up. The people are still coming. You guys really need to educate yourselves on what racism is. Um, this is why these things keep happening is because people are too scared to speak up because they think that it's being racist. It's not because if another white person was doing that, would you feel any type of way of telling them, pull your pants up, don't be doing that on a beach? Thought so. We need to stop normalizing this. This is why things like this keep happening and there's so much that's happening because we are too afraid of being called racist to stand up for just what's right in general. This has nothing to do with targeting someone based off their skin color and everything to do with protecting our beaches, our parks. Th these are places that everyone is supposed to be able to go to and enjoy. These aren't your personal outhouses. How are people supposed to know and learn if people aren't calling them out? Stop being afraid to be racist and stand up for what's right. If you fucking see something, say something. There, I feel no fucking way about it. And you guys should too. So... Now, oh, it's pretty infuriating, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Going back to the whole third world, get the third world thing, here's another video to shed light on the matter. The video you're about to see now was produced by UNICEF India to encourage Indians to defecate in toilets and not in public. Keep this in mind, folks. This video was produced to educate some of the very people making your Tim Horton sandwich. You're welcome. <laughs> Do I see a pile of shit staring at me? I close my eyes, I step away. No matter where I go, there's no getting away. Everywhere. The next 
Well, that's it for now. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't done so, please subscribe. I'll see you later.